everyone, Kimberly Burke here with the Rebel Fit Club, the Pacific Northwest largest Parkinson specific gym. Today I'm going to be talking to you more about frozen shoulder or shoulders that have limited range of motion. We know that Parkinson's tends to round us forward, so this is a very common symptom and people give into it thinking, well, I can't move my shoulder anymore, so I'm not going to move it and then it just perpetuates and gets worse. So last week I did a video on how to get your arm behind. Now today we're gonna to talk about exercising your arm sideways. Now, notice that I'm up against a wall today. I find with my clients that this is the most useful to have a wall behind you because with Parkinson's, there's a lot of other things that go on like balance issues. So this not only gives us some stability, it also provides a great way to measure your progress. So the tool that we're gonna use is either a PVC pipe, or in this one's probably about a yard long. Uh, you can use a dowel, you can use your cane, you can use a broom handle, any of those will work. So we're gonna start out standing nice and tall, and as you notice today, I have my hoodie on because I'm gonna use the sleeve to actually help me out. So I'm gonna pull the sleeve down over my hand and grab onto the end of the dowel like this with my thumb facing upward. The other hand, so this would be the frozen shoulder, the other hand is just gonna be hanging onto the dowel over here. This side is gonna be completely passive and relaxed. This is gonna be our active side. So we're gonna start out by actively pushing while this side is relaxed, push it up the wall to the point where you don't think you can go any further. Like that's about as far as you may wanna go. And you're gonna put this hand against your belly and this hand is just gonna relax and hang out there. Now remember the thumbs are pointing up. So you're gonna breathe, just be in the moment, kind of feel where your shoulder is at, maybe move your head side to side Take another breath in, see if you can go another inch. Okay, so maybe that's as far as you can go. Now remember, don't compensate by leaning to the side. You wanna be straight and hang out there. Now, this is where you wanna take note. How far up the wall did you go? And go ahead and bring it down. You're gonna take another breath in and actively push that hand up. Maybe we could go another inch hang out there for a few breaths and bring it down. So you wanna keep doing this about 10 times and then slowly increase it to 20 and trying to get that range up higher and higher. So that's my quick tip for today. If you add it to last week's video, you're starting to build on a catalog of exercises to help with your range of motion. It's very important. So if you like this video, please hit the subscribe button below or go to my website at rebelfitclub.com and subscribe to my weekly blog that is filled with exercise tips and tricks for you to help manage your own Parkinson's. You can also contact me at Kimberly at rebelfitclub.com and I'm happy to get back to you and talk to you about your individual symptoms and how exercise can help you. We now have our virtual classes. They are live, not pre-recorded to help you stay safe in your home. We can hook you up with those and we are also starting to open our gym. So please contact us, we are so happy to help you. Our virtual classes are not going away once everything opens up. So please consider that as an option for you to stay safe. Thank you so much and as always, go forth and conquer.